Hello, hello, hello everyone. How are you? We're going to be using some cutouts and a, um, a chalk transfer, chalk couture transfer as well. We're going to be making ornaments. Oh, I did not get the one mom used last night. Well, that stinks. That's okay. We'll just use this one. Oh, y'all, and I wanted to show you, in case you didn't see, this is the same transfer. This is the project mom did last night, in case you didn't see. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Isn't that fun? It looks like it's busting out of there. But I just wanted to show y'all another way to use this transfer, and we have the wood cutouts to go with it. Um, Hope everybody's doing good. Be sure and let me know when you hop on. Hey, Elizabeth. Um, but we're going to be making some ornaments, guys. And I'm just going to do super... Oh, I hear Clementine crying. Hey, Christina. I'm just going to go super simple with this. Mom is in the kitchen making like a chicken risotto Facebook recipe. I cannot wait to taste it. Hey, Diana. Hey. Let's see. Oh, Elizabeth. Hey, girl. Betsy. Hello. Hey, Joanne. So glad y'all are on here with me. Um, like I said, I'm just going to go super simple with this one. Hey, Susan. I'm going to paint. Um, the background's going to be Waverly chalk paint and snow white. And y'all, have y'all ordered the wood cutouts and used a hole punch? Super simple to just pop a hole in them. Oh, and the word, if you're watching on Refresh Restyle, hey Sue, um, the keyword is ornaments. Keyword is ornaments. On my page, I mean you could type it, but you're not gonna get a you're not gonna get a message with the um links. I do have featured links, so those should be showing up with them. But if you comment ornaments, I'll come back and send it to you if you're on my page. But if you're on mom's page, type ornaments and you should get a message with the supply list. Whoop, whoop. Like I said, if you're on my page, it's not going to send you a message, but I'll come back and send it to you. But we're just going to go super simple with this. We're going to do a white background and y'all this one is called these minis are called naughty nice and it comes with it, the wood cutouts come with all the pieces too but i thought i would just use the small ones for the ornaments thanks so much for sprinkling i appreciate it y'all that food smells so good. And I hear Clementine outside the door crying a little bit. She wants in here with me. <laughs> Thank you, Sharon. Oh, what are y'all doing? Y'all, I know what day it is today. It's Sunday. <laughs> what have y'all been doing today? Hey, Cindy. And I'm just going to be using red, a red and green paste for these. The green I'm using is pesto, and the red is cherry. They are gorgeous. Hey, Angela, I'm so good. How are you? Hey, Corrine. So glad y'all were able to join me. Do y'all ever make the recipes off of Facebook? Like when you see people post them on Facebook, have y'all ever made any? Hey, Donna. Y'all, I woke up, and Mom said she did too with a headache this morning. Our dreams must have been wild. Do they usually turn out good, Elizabeth? Mom is making one that she found on Facebook. I think she said she found it on Facebook. I have not got my ice cream, but I do plan on getting some. I love ice cream. It's one of my favorite things, and y'all, I don't really like sharing it. I'll, I'll, I mean, I will, but I don't like sharing it. <laughs> I'm stingy. I'm stingy with ice cream. There's other foods. Like, I don't really like sharing my food. 
I don't really like sharing the food off my plate. Of course, I'm a mom, so I do. Hey, Christine. Oh, cool. You put some blueberries on a towel, Corrine. Awesome. And thank you. This shirt, y'all, it's really old, but I think I got it from a boutique here in town called Flirty Birds. I have so many favorite ice creams, but when we went to see my brother in Georgia, oh, was that last summer? We went to Jenny's Ice Cream. Um, y'all, I got a lavender lemon that was absolutely amazing and I keep thinking about it because you can actually order her ice cream and have it shipped to you. I don't know. I don't pretty sure they don't make it anymore though. Hey Jamie, you just now finished it. What's y'all's favorite ice cream? I also love like mint chocolate chip and my favorite place here in town is called Shaved Ice Barn. They have amazing coffee and ice cream, and right now I'm hooked on the lemon bar. It's amazing. Hey, Lori. Oh, what's Blue Moon? What flavors is that? But I so wish that I could find a lavender lemon like that Jenny's ice cream because that was absolutely amazing. Oh, pralines and peach sounds yummy. Y'all, ice cream is probably one of my favorite, favorite things to eat. I also love um, Froyo, frozen yogurt. Huge fan of that. <laughs> salted car caramel. I love anything salted caramel. There's probably not many ice creams I wouldn't love, just to be quite honest. <laughs> Do y'all feel the same way? I am using the Waverly Chalk Paint in Snow White. I'm just going super simple with this. Um, one reason is, is because I'm just super simple. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for sprinkling, guys. Oh, I love Sherbert too, Susan. You do not like black cherry. Oh, that one, black cherry. I feel like I would like that. Hey, Deborah. Thanks so much for sprinkling. Thank you for stars. Vanilla ice cream with blackberry. Warm stir. Oh, that sounds amazing, Margaret. Hey, Shirley. Y'all, if you're watching on Mom's Pay. Ooh, strawberry banana. Yes. Um. If you're watching on mom's page, the keyword is ornaments to get the links. If you're on the Jenny Glover, if you type ornaments, when I get off, I'll send you the links. <laughs> Thank you, Karen. Leela, that's how I feel. I feel like there's probably not much that I would not love. Let me get my dryer out and maybe I can watch the comments. I hate, I always hate missing comments. Hey, Debbie. Um, Y'all, oh, I have not introduced myself. That's how I feel, Corrine. There's probably not much of it that I wouldn't love to eat. Um, but for those of you who do not know me, my name is Jenny from The Jenny Glover. If you're not following me, I would love for you to. I'm Debbie's daughter. I'm Miss Refresh's daughter. Just going to try to dry these really quick. Oh, I hear my sweet Clementine outside the door crying. She wants me. Hey, Deb. Becky, again, on my page, I'll send you the, the links if you type ornaments in. You're not going to get an automatic message. Because I don't know how to do that yet, but I'm going to learn. I keep saying I'm going to learn. There's so much stuff to learn, guys. Hey, Debbie, I'm so glad you caught me. Hey, Darcy. Thank y'all so much for watching. Thank you, Angela. I got this. It's really old. I got it. Well, it's not that old, but 
several years ago from a boutique here in town called Flirty Birds. Okay, good. Oh, cool. The twine holder. Mom added this too. Isn't that spectacular? I'm in love. That's great. And for those of y'all who weren't on at the beginning, this is the project Mom did last night. It's using these same transfers. Isn't that awesome? I love it, love it, love it. So much fun. Looks like Santa's sleigh is just coming right through. But this is the same transfer. But I'm just going to be using all the smaller ones. But our, we, the wood cutouts, it does come with the, the naughty and the nice. And then the Santa and the sleigh, too. So you'll get the whole set if you order these. But I didn't figure I'd turn those into ornaments. Hey, Gail. Hey, Belinda. Hey, you are not going to get an automatic message on my page, Belinda. But anybody that types ornaments on my page, I'll send you the links. I love the busting. Hey, Jeannie. Crafting and what? Oh, yeah, you're crafting. Well, she didn't really like the tree, Debbie, so she took it off. <laughs> oh, goodness. Thanks so much for sprinkling, guys, and thanks for the stars. I keep touching a wet one. Oh, that one's still wet, too. All right, I need to focus on these. And like I said, these are going to be super simple. Because that's how I am. That's how I roll. I do, I do need to touch up these that I've just touched my fingers all over while they were wet. That was quick. <laughs> hey, Anita. So what's everybody been doing today? It clouded up here like it was going to storm, but I think it might, might, uh, I think it might really kind of miss us. <laughs> we do need a little bit of rain though, would be nice. I'm looking around for my water. I didn't bring my water in here. Hey, Lisa. She is a good cook, Joanne. She doesn't do anything. She's a, she's good at everything. Oh, watching musicals. Cleaning house. Oh, I needed to do that sometime. Thank you, Belinda. Those are so fun. Cindy, you've been crafting. I love making those little, they're kind of like a Santa gnome out of toilet paper rolls and yarn. Too hot in Southern California to do much. Trish, you just need to stay in and relax, huh? Well, I tell you what, when it blew up that storm earlier, it dropped the temperatures here. Hey, Cheryl. Belinda, you need to try to make some of those little Santa gnomes. They're really easy to make, and they're kind of fun, and they're a good little way to pass the time. I think that one's dry. Now I probably just need to let them cool off a little bit. Oh, y'all went to the airport. He loves watching airplanes, doesn't he, Belinda? Hey, Martha. I'm so glad y'all are on here this afternoon. Let these cool down a little bit. Y'all, I'm going to have to, I'm going to dust my mat off a little bit so that my transfer doesn't get, you know, when the paint dries on the cap and it just crumbles out of there. <laughs> That's what's happened. Thank you, Joanne. Those are so much fun to make. Hey, Shamra. I wonder, I'm going to try.
try to, I might just try to do these without cutting them out. Christine, if you type ornaments in, you should, I, mom, are you still watching? Because I think she said that she, um, I think she said she put the link. Where is, I don't think I got any wax. I think she said she put the link in there for the twine holder. Super cute. And I'm just, that's what I'm going to be using as twine. There we go. I'm going to add a little bit of surface wax to these. Just to um, try to keep it from sticking and it doesn't change the color or anything. It just helps the transfer not stick and peel your paint up. You just put your little bit on. And y'all, if you're on my page and you type ornaments in, when I get off, I'll, I'll send you the links. Thanks, Chris. Thanks so much for sprinkling. Y'all, we appreciate you helping, helping us get out there for everybody. Sharing with your friends, family, acquaintances. Yeah, Leela, it just doesn't work on my page. I'm live on my page, the Jenny Glover, and Mom's page. And on her page, the keyword should be working. You got rain last night, like Han Valinda. But this wax is pretty great. It helps keep your transfer from sticking too good to your cutouts and peeling the paint up. Cause you don't want that. Nobody wants that. And y'all, if you're not following the Jenny Glover after the live, run over there and give me a follow. Hey, Vivian. Huh. Are you, did you check your um, messages? Because it sends, sends it to your messages. All right. And then here's the transfer. It's called Naughty Nice. Naughty Nice Mini, sorry. I love that the Chalk Couture Transfers has, has the name down. <laughs> yes, yes, definitely. Oh, I'm throwing, I'm throwing down my minis, y'all. Not purposely either. Okay, I'm going to try to do this without, um, cutting the transfer up. Mom might whip me because I should have just used the transfer she used last night because, y'all, these transfers are sticky and reusable. That's what's so great about them. You just re keep reusing them. All right, that one's going to be green, green. And, y'all, I'm not getting crazy with these. Green, green, green. Let me see here. Maybe I could get all the green on here. And then, wait, what did I do with the green? Oh, I thought I lost one. <laughs> oh, my goodness, y'all. I never cease to amaze myself. Sometimes in a good way, sometimes in not so good of a way. Oh, and y'all just kind of line these up. It's close. To, <laughs> I still hear Clementine. I went home after lunch and got her 
took both of our dogs out. One of my dogs is super antisocial. <laughs> she never wants to come with me, but Clementine loves coming to Yaya and Pop Pop's house. Mia prefers having people come visit her if there's going to be any visiting. But I hear Clementine outside the door really wanting me. Y'all, she is getting huge. She's five months old and she's 64 pounds. I got on the scale with her. I think yesterday. All right, I'm gonna do these in, wait, no, I could have used Meadow, but I'm using Pesto because I love Pesto. I like eating Pesto and I love, look how gorgeous that color is. It's beautiful. Look, I gotta be honest, I have not been completely prepared today. Then just gently, you don't have to press down hard like I always, I don't, I told mom, I was like, I don't know why I think I need to press so hard. You don't press hard with this. If you do and you're getting like goops of chalk paste everywhere, that's why. You just gently, there's no need to use a lot of pressure. And hey, I apologize if I miss your comments. I do try to go back and read and respond. If you're on my page and you type ornaments, I will send you the links personally because I don't know how to set this fancy smancy stuff up. All right, let me go ahead and pull. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Ah, uh, look how cute these are. Aren't those gorgeous? And doesn't that pesto look so good on the white? I love it. All right, now let me do the um, pine cone and the greenery. And like I said, you don't have to press down hard. Just get you a little bit of paste. But you don't want to let the paste dry. You don't want to let it dry on there because it, it possibly will peel up. So you want to peel it up while it's still wet. <gasps> Look at the gorgeous pine cone and pine needles. Love them. Okay, now this is the bell. That's that. All right, let me try to do this. I'm hopeful that I can get all of these, because I'm gonna do all of these in red. Oh yeah. And hopefully, oh y'all, I cannot wait to see these. And I'm just using twine to make my hangers with. Well, nope, nope, nope. I need to go down a little bit further. And then I need to be careful not to get it <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> All right, let me put that in my paint water. Y'all, these are so stinking cute. I'm gonna use some of mom's words. I love that Christmas tree. But you could do tons of these. Oh, and you know what else? Thanks so much for the stars. Y'all, these would be so cute. You know how when you make bows and you can add like a little something? These would be perfect for adding these to your bows when you give your friends gifts. Look at that cherry. Oh my gosh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, I can't wait to see how pretty this looks. And like I said, these transfers are reusable. That's why I should have used the one mom did last night, but I don't I don't know what I was thinking. I'm not even sure where it is. Oh, that cherry looks gorgeous. Look how pretty. Oh, thank you for sprinkling. 
cute as, yes, it would be cute as stuffies. But I always like when I do the bow, especially when, cause y'all, I'm gonna be honest, I don't, cause let's just be for real. Most people nowadays, if they want something, they go ahead and go buy it. So really, in all honesty, we don't need a whole lot. So I just get like super simple gifts, but then I just might try to make it special with the wrapping. And this would be gorgeous on your gifts, like tied into the bow. Thanks so much for the stars, guys. Isn't that beautiful? All right, and now the gift. Just get you a little paste on your squeegee. And y'all, you could definitely be more detailed with this and, and add the different colors. But I just thought this would be cute, simple, quick. Oh, oh my gosh, and I didn't even notice this. But the package says Merry Christmas. I don't know if y'all are able to see that. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, I'm gonna sit this over here to the side, put that in my water, get my paste out of the way. Whoop, I'm throwing stuff down. I think I keep, and y'all, I keep, I'm back here barefoot. <laughs> I love running around with no shoes on. Hey, Betty. Hey, Andrea. Thank y'all so much for watching and sprinkling and sending stars. We appreciate it very much. I'm just drying these really quick. Okay, there's my hole punch. And I don't know if you have used these hole punch. They are so cute, aren't they? Oh, you know what would be pretty? Thank you for the stars. Um, it's like black background with that beautiful nominee, that really pretty gold. That it's good for you to walk around barefoot. Outside, it's called, I think it's called grounding. And it doesn't take long for this paste to dry. I love paste. I think the shimmers do stay wet a little bit longer, but it's it's not an issue. I'm so glad y'all could join me. I'm excited. Okay, I think those are all dry. And then I'm just gonna, like I said, this is just a big hole punch. And you just make sure your hole punch is on the wood because sometimes I don't make sure of that. <laughs> Hi, Denise. Oh, look, I love giving people gifts. Give, giving people gifts is like one of my favorite things. It makes me so happy, but I try not to shop too early because I like to go ahead and give. I'm not good at keeping stuff. Y'all, I think I just clipped through the wood with that one. I'm gonna make sure I get down a little bit further with this one. Thank you, Debbie. Thanks so much, y'all. We really appreciate your sprinkles and the stars. Super excited. So I might have to like fix something up with this one because I clipped through the I didn't get it far enough down. I'm a silly goose. Let's see here. Where do I want this one? But you can see how easy it is to just punch right through. Makes really clean lines. I think this, yeah, it's chalk couture too. But you could probably use whatever. I don't know. This is, it's a good size so you can really get your hands on it. But these will be gorgeous hanging on your tree. Wonder if I could like put a little bit. Oh, where 
y'all. I do have, I'm going to try to fix something up since I cut through, <laughs> since I took things a little too far with one of them, but this will be a good example for everybody. All right, and then I'm just going to cut me some twine. You know what, you could actually just, because they make some pretty fancy, um, what am I trying to say? They make some pretty fancy hooks, so if you didn't want to use hooks, I mean, twine or any kind of, um, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Oh, and you could also use, like, you know, those little, really little thin bits of uh, ribbon. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm not good at talking and doing. <laughs> oh, gosh, y'all. I can't do two things at once. Hey, Michelle. Thank y'all so much for joining. I'm just adding a little bit of twine and I might not I might not have to do anything crazy because that might be thick enough but some pretty little thin pieces of colored ribbon look how cute that is I kind of like it with the twine too but also you know I was thinking if you did some some of these in black with the um, nominee y'all that might be my new favorite color Thank you, Kathy. But these would be cute little happies to put on your your in your wrapping. Tie tie these tie one of these into your bows, and you could def, definitely do both sides of it. Unless you want to be trying to make sure that they're turned right, but definitely you could do both sides, y'all. I'm gonna try. this one because I clipped I clipped it too close to the edge but I'm gonna see if this will yeah oh you know what I did that one second it still works wonderful <laughs> Wouldn't they be gorgeous in the nominee, the black, or like a dark? But, you know, you could also just do these in, in the colors that you like to use. And like I said, you could definitely get more detailed with them. And, and do the pine cone in brown. Do the holly leaves in green. Oh, great idea. You could just leave the back painted white and write their name on it. Those, these are so, so, so cute. And y'all, super simple, super fast. If you're on Refresh Restyle, keyword is ornaments, and you will get um, a message. You'll have to go to Messenger, but it'll come with the supply list. If you're on my page and you type ornaments, I'll just um, send you the links. Or you could click on the links button and see the links as well. Oh, wrong way. I love that. And like you could do this one. You could do the flame a different color. Oh. Uh. There's a lot of possibilities with this, guys. And you can make them. What's great is you can customize them. Or if you are using them as a uh, name tag for your gifts, you could do your friend's favorite color or colors they like to use. This one might be my favorite, the bells with the holly. That's beautiful. Actually, no, definitely the tree is my favorite. <laughs> Y'all will have to let me know what your favorite is. Get all my little holes I punched out. And I'm going to put these. I can never find the um, hole punch when I'm looking for it. Do y'all do that? 
Oh, you do? Oh, yes. These would be perfect for a mini tree. The key word is ornament. Okay, yours, your favorite is the tree, yes. But, y'all, yes, these would be perfect for the little mini trees. Great size. Love it, love it. They are so fun, Anita. Thank y'all so much for joining me. I'm going to get off here, and hopefully Mom's done cooking. And I'm going to get me a bite of this. I don't even know what it's called. It's some sort of... Uh, Oh, a banner would be cute, too, Sue. Hey, Jenny. Belinda, I'll send the link when I get off of here. You're not going to get an automatic link on my page. Unfortunately, I don't know how to do that yet. Or I may not have the option to. I don't know. <laughs> but thank y'all so much for joining me. I'm fixing to get in here and eat this chicken recipe that, that Mom got off of Facebook. Y'all have a great rest of the afternoon. Thank you. Bye-bye.